Do you want people to be able to pop up memes just using channel points? Or do you want people to be able to do it with just a command? In this video, we're gonna learn how to do that with Lior on board. My name is Tree and I make streamless support videos. Seems so smarter, no harder. Before I begin this video, I need to tell you that you have to watch this video first if you haven't actually connected your OBS to your Lior on board yet and you still have to download Lior on board and you have never heard of it. Go down first because those are the basics to set things up before we can actually do something with the program. I would recommend to pause this video, go to the other video, watch that first, and then come back here to watch the rest of it. If you've already set that up, you're good to go, let's go. So the first thing we want to do is go to OBS and actually add a meme. So we're going to OBS and then we're gonna click here on a plus and we need to add an image or a media source. This depends on if you actually added an image or a video. So for a video, we click on media source. For image, we click on image. Let's do a media source and call it a name. We don't have to give it a proper name right now, but if you are gonna add multiple, I definitely recommend calling it something that you would recognize. And then click on OK and browse. Well, here we can just find something that we can use in OBS. So here I got a meme and I'm gonna click on it and open it. If you want it to loop, you can click on loop. If you don't want it to loop, don't click on it. And then restart playback when source become active. Make sure that that is on. It is automatically on, but you need to make sure that it's on anyway. And then we're gonna edit. 45, I'm gonna come enable on. this real quick so I can see what you guys can see. On, it's and I'm gonna make it 40, the size 45. I want it to be. Let's say I want it to be this size it's here in OBS. We have a bit of an inception because I'm recording OBS with OBS. But if we play this, it will appear, and if we stop playing it, it will disappear, and it keeps starting at the start whenever we activate it. So media source 2 here, and now we're gonna lock it in place because I like to lock things. I know things are not locked in here because this is my OBS scene and not the scene I'm actually using for streaming. So we got the media source here, and we want it to play. If you have multiple memes that you want to play, I would recommend ma making a new scene because this way you can add all the memes to one scene and then add a scene by doing this and then add scene to an existing scene where you want all the memes to be in and then you can basically just use that one scene for multiple scenes. So if you want it in your camera scene but also in your gameplay scene, you only have to do it in one scene and add that one scene to both scenes. I hope that was clear because that was a lot of saying the word scene and that might have made it a little bit unclear. So we have our meme here, our 45 meme. It will start and stop playing when we activate it and deactivate it. So that's what we want to do with the onboard. We're gonna open the onboard, make a new deck or just Add it to our existing deck. So this is our existing deck. Create a new one, call it 45, because that's how the meme is called, 45. I'm gonna make the button a little bit bigger. Up. Up. There we go. If you want smaller squares like I have, you can change the grid here. So this is the 45 one we have just made. I'm just keeping it here, it's fine. And then right click, add command. What we want to do is add source. Oh, I can't type. Oh, that's really bad. Source. Change visibility. And then what we want to do is source item. Uh, you want to see which scene it is on. It's on scene five item. It's called media source two and visibility needs to be true. Then we want to make a second one, uh, which probably is easier to just copy. <laughs> to be honest, it's just easier to copy this one. So click, copy all selected, paste. And then here we want to be false. Okay, what we want to do now is we want it to turn on, but we don't want it to immediately turn off. We want it to turn off when the video is done. So what we need to do is we need to search the video, right click it, go to properties. And we need to see how long it is. Details. It is 12 seconds in length. So we wanted to play for 12 seconds. The thing here though, is it says milliseconds. If I'm correct, this means it's 12,000 milliseconds. If I'm not correct, we're gonna find that out in a second. And then we click on done. This gets triggered, it gets on and turns itself off after 12 seconds. But now we need to connect that to our channel points. We're gonna go to our Twitch, view rewards, channel points, manage rewards and challenges. Here, we're gonna add a new one, as new custom command, call it 45 meme. It shows the 45 meme on stream. And it costs, let's say it costs 100 channel points. We can set a color here as well. If you want to have another color, we can change it to whatever we want. If you don't know how the channel points work, 
I'll leave a link here to the channel point video I have already so you learn more about custom channel points and everything like that. You can set the cooldown and everything, whatever you want. And we need to make sure that we copy the title. So make sure that you copy the title and create it. We're gonna go back to Leoran board and right click on 45 and add Twitch trigger. Plus, point redeem, click. Paste the name here and click on done. So click on done, boom. Now we're gonna go to our own channel. Go to Chad, go to channel points, find the 45 main and click on it. 45, come on. Come on, it's 45, 45. It's on playing. And now it's still playing. And we should be able to trigger it again by doing it again. It's 45, come on. As you can see, it started over from the beginning. We can do this with as many memes as we want by just adding more to OBS and adding them to your Leon board. But don't forget to connect them to your channel points. If they don't play, you're probably not in this menu, but you're still in here. If they're, if you're in this part, they don't play. So click on done and then they will play. You need to be in this and this needs to all be connected. Otherwise it doesn't work. I promised you guys also to tell you how to do it with commands in chat. You just add another Twitch trigger and instead of the memes, you will add a chat message. 45. You can do exclamation mark 45 if you want to be at a command. And then here we can set that subs and mods can do it or just everybody. So we click on done, done, go to the chat. Uh, 45. And like you see, this is also started the meme. This is super easy to just add if you want it for a command as well as for channel points. I got a playlist with really warm board things and how to set them up. And I think it's fun if you join me there. So just hop into this playlist and I will see you there. Click on it. You can do it. I'll see you there.